Buddy, sorry, Pebbles, we gotta go. Nope. Oh, God. Fucking ate the top of that roof. Yeah, this kind of travel definitely is uh, far better for getting around and trying to run everywhere. That's for damn sure. Savage! I need to save that so whenever I, you know, roast somebody online, I can be like savage. I've earned the savage perk because I am an animal. This horse can book it, that's for damn sure. Hello, strange wandering person. Damn, it got all naturey all of a sudden, didn't it? Sweet, got a horseman perk. Horsemanship perk. Let's check that out. Horsemanship. Heavy duty pony. The horse can can carry more, but is slower. Can't be combined with race horse. Uh, your horse is faster, but carries less weight. Uh... Yeah, that's kind of meh. I don't really want it to be slower. I definitely don't want to carry less. That's for damn sure. That's the opposite. So we definitely won't be picking that. I wonder how much slower. We'll have to think on that one. But I mean, if it's way slower, then that would suck. Kind of wish they give specifics, but but that's fine, I guess. God, look at the woods, all the hunting we could do here. Get that hunting skill up, and almost as important, actually probably more important, is getting that agility up. Ah, this looks very herbalist house. Howdy, ma'am. How you doing? Oh, we could learn alchemy from her too. Herb woman. She didn't have a name. I've come in the name of Sahanish of Lyper. I'm investigating uh, the massacre in Neuhof, and now a murder here as well. Can I ask you a few questions? Ask all you want, lad. Who was this Lubosh who was murdered? Those that live by the sword die by the sword. I'm not surprised the end he came to. Have you noticed anything suspicious recently? Everything about him was suspicious. I always gave him a wide berth. Right, but the, the when I hovered over her, it just said herb woman. It didn't say her name, which was kind of weird. Do you know what Lubosch was doing the day Neuhoff was raided? How would I know? How would you know? Do you know who Lubosch used to spend time with? Be awfully evasive. I don't know, since I don't go to alehouses. Are you too good for it? That's all. Thank you. Before I piss Can you, you teach off, me something about medicinal herbs. Certainly. Herbs. First of all, it's herbs, not herbs. I'd like to practice the basics. All right, but it'll cost you. I know. <laughs> How much? She's like, eh, try again, boy. Isn't that quite a lot? It's not money I want. What do you say to this? You won't convince me with that. That's what she... Wait. Agreed. Now, listen up. She does a rap about herbs. So does that actually use time? I don't think it does. So it's like, what? Uh, almost nine, which is seven o'clock. Because I kind of want her to teach me more. Well, herbalism, I guess she doesn't really need to teach me about. Now I think about it. Where is our herbalism at now, by the way? It's like our highest skill. It's max is 20, for God's sakes. Uh, level 6. And none of these perks are really that crazy good. Except this one. Herb picking will add experience to your strength. That I do like, actually. Like, quite a bit. We should be able to train the higher level, too, now. And I realize, too, you can do train more than once. Certainly. 
Oh my god, yeah, if you were a completionist and try to play this game, it would be crazy. I'm interested in more advanced techniques. Alright, but it'll cost you. Oh, I thought this would be free. 180. Hmm. Isn't that so, wow, three enough? times as much. Since it's you. Since it's you, shut up. Right pinch purse. Hmm. Decent Agreed. amount saved. Now, listen up. Yeah, check my time. Yeah, I was going to. Uh, but I'm glad you said it because I might have forgot. Nope, it does not use any time at all. Just money. But that, what does I see? I put her herb, herbalism at? Seven. Sweet. Uh, money wise, though. We'll, we'll wait. I do want to see what she has to sell. Bane potion. Consumption causes strong nausea and massive death. Uh, and that massive health loss is leading to death. Oh, you know what? I wonder if you could, like, if you snuck into a camp and replaced, like, if you could, like, pour that into somebody's drink, if you could kill them that way. Uh, also, why is Henry out of focus here? That's kind of weird. Huh. Anyway, black feathers, doll maker potion. Your muscles atrophy and you lose control of your limbs. Sounds like a good time. Your entire body feels wooden and you can only move with great difficulty. Your combat skills with weapons and without are reduced by five for 10 minutes and your stamina is lowered by 50%. You can't sprint. Ooh. Oh, she gets an herb book too. Only be read after cheating. Level 10, yowzas. Holy shit, 518? That's expensive. Uh, I might grab that perk to make books less. Hair of the dog potion. Make your mornings easier, but at what price? It cures drunkenness, prevents a hangover, and cures alcoholism. Your charisma is reduced by two for one hour. Pfft, that, ain't, that ain't squat. That's a pretty cheap uh, fix for that, though. Um... Poison. This is just poison. Uh, I want to see. We did have one for that, right? What was I looking for? Oh, right. Reading. Oh, damn it. Oh, where should we pick that? Shit. Well, I want that now. Now I want Colleague, because that book is expensive. All right. I definitely going to piss her off though cuz I want her training. From the priest. They're saying you incited some women to witchcraft. Me? Witchcraft? That's nothing but idle chatter. Oh, wow. We get threaten her really good. Don't you know that witches get burned alive? There's no need for trouble. I'll tell you everything. I've done a very foolish thing. It's preying on my mind so much I can't sleep a wink. Well, I'm supposed to believe an old witch has pangs of conscience. Laugh if you like, but it's not a word of a lie. You probably know I sell various magic lotions and potions alongside my herbs. Well, there's one I wish I hadn't sold. You see? Vera, Zlata, and Kuta from Ujits wanted a magic ointment from me. I kept refusing them, but in the end, I let them talk me into it. What kind of ointment was it? One that will show you a world no one else can see. A place of wonder and terror. The flowers might start talking to you, or the earth could swallow you up. I don't so crystal know meth. if it's the work of the devil or of God himself, but the ointment has that power. But it could poison any person who doesn't know how to use it right. So all this talk of witches anointing themselves and then flying to their Sabbaths on broomsticks... The ointment could make a person see such things. But it was stupid of me letting those foolish women get their hands on it. They could poison themselves or fall off a cliff while they're lost in a dream. 
Will you give me the ointment recipe? It contains belladonna and the herb Paris, both quite poisonous plants. That ought to make you think twice about dabbling with it. What kind of ointment was it? One that will show you a world okay. no... I don't know. So all this talk of the ointment... I want to know... I was wondering why like, that one was acting like we hadn't asked about it. That was just kind of weird. So why did you give them the ointment at all? Because I'm soft-hearted. You see, one of those women, Bera, lost her whole family in Skalitz. And Zlata's husband was killed. And the youngest of them, Kuta, miscarried with the horror of it all. They said they wanted to use the ointment to speak with the dead and ask them to put a word in with the Lord. Yeah. I understand how they feel. But I reckon it'll get them nowhere but the ducking stool and the stake. Judge not, lest ye be judged. I didn't want to give them the ointment, but they offered me a pile of groschen. So I thought how desperate they must be, and I heard their plea. Their plea, or the clink of their coin? And why are you so worried about them all of a sudden? What changed your mind? I'm losing sleep over it. Firstly, those women don't know what they're doing. And secondly, folk might see it as witchcraft. And do you know what they do to witches? They burn them alive. That they do. So don't Praise be God. surprised. I'm worried. It didn't bother you before, though. What did they want the ointment for? Each one of them lost a loved one recently, and it's grieving them. They wanted to talk with the dead. I've heard enough. If you've heard enough, you must understand why I need your help. Find out from those women what they intend, and watch over them to keep them safe. Very well. But only because the priest himself asked me to. Thank you a thousandfold. I'll go to the reverend myself and explain. You take care of those women. Alright. Now we know what happened. Too bad we couldn't uh, get a little bit of that money from her. Maybe at night we'll uh, come visit. Speaking of... Chicken, you best not rat me out. Don't mind me. Oh. The old wise ointment that the witches used in the Sabbaths and thus condemned their souls to Lucifer. Beware of using it lest you lose control of your own body and soul. Sure. Nah. I don't really have... I don't... Actually, you know what? I'll take that stuff. I could put him on the horse. Aqua Fortis. Nah. So we did get the recipe. I already wanted to look at it again. An old wise ointment that the witches use in their Sabbaths and thus condemn their souls to Lucifer. But we're using it. That's blah, blah, blah. So wait a minute. So is that actually... Well, I mean, true within the context of what they understand. So like... I wonder if I can ask her about this book now. Be like, yo, what's up with this? I found this book. Don't ask how I found it. Just understand that I found it. Because I definitely don't want to... Well... Ah, damn it. I can't. All right, horsey. Let's drop my stuff off on... Oh, wait. That didn't count as stealing. What? Hmm. Okay. I mean, I'm fine with that. That seems a little weird. Well, 
Or maybe it does, it's just not showing up as that for some reason. Hmm. All right, well, whatever. All right, let's go check up on these ladies. Nice place you got here, though. I like it. It's rustic. Can't really get too much rustic, I guess, than this place. If I could get a like place to live like this, all woodsy and away from people, but also with really high-speed internet and Chinese delivery service, I'd be down with that. Ooh. Echo, honk your horn. Get a honk your horn when you go through tunnels. I mean, I had the lockpick to get in there, into the chest. I don't know. I don't know why it wasn't stealing. But hey, let's not question it. Let's just blow through this forest with our horse. And go check on these ladies. Doesn't sound like we needed to talk to the priest again. And like I say, this, this book has got me wondering, though, because, I mean, it did say that uh talks about giving your soul to satan and all that but i mean of course that which could have been the old you know primitive people everything was giving your soul to satan basically let's take a look at our quest real quick yeah it doesn't say anything about going back to him All right, which one is closest? Um, oh, she's down there. Okay, so we'll uh, go back, head this, head down this road because there's two of them. Then we'll go to the south side of town. Talk to the third lady. Wait, what curls for some saves coming? Did I tell you about my what have we done that needs to be safe scummed? I kind of want to get that talent to make it so we sleep less, just so we can stay up like at night longer. And uh, we'll wash ourselves a bit. Oh, god damn it. Hmm. Let's see if there. What time is it? Why are you already in bed? Or maybe they're just not at home. Or they could be at work. I was checking around the house to see if I see anything. All right, so we might pass on her for now. I kind of want to break in and see if she's actually all right. Let's check B first. Damn it. They're all going to be dead in their house. Hmm. I don't even think that's the same house. Not her. All right, what do you have, lady? Oh, God bless. not much of a trader, are you? If I can't trade with you, hey, hey, getting back again. Dang it! If you don't want me in your private areas, you need to be uh, locking me out. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's go over here. Oh, she's in there asleep. Well, hopefully asleep and not dead. Let's see what our visibility is. 36. Not great, but not terrible. Look around. Chickens. Is 
I'm trying to talk to her. Why are you here? Bugger off. Oh. Well, she's alive. Maybe she'll come out at night. I'm not even in your house. Oh, well, okay. Now she'll talk to me. I heard something about a magic ointment that you got from the herb woman. You heard that where? Herb woman. And what business is it of yours? The herb woman sent me. Gertrude? Herb woman. What does she want? Haven't we paid her enough? The woman is quite dangerous. That's not the point. The ointment's dangerous, and the herb woman doesn't want you herb to do anything woman. foolish. Thanks for the concern, but we're grown women. We're old enough to make our own Damn choices, and what we do in the woods at night is no one's business but ours. Oh, really? In the woods at night, eh? Thanks for telling me. So they do come out at night, mostly. They mostly come out at night. Kind of breaking this other lady's house now. Yeah, I mean these are like easy locks too, so that helps. I'm mostly picking this one just for the XP. They did say too, this is not the same thing. But they did. There's nobody there. What are, you look talk what are you looking at, bitch? You got a problem? Say something. Say something, hater. You My best step on. You. Best mind your business. Wait, what? I'm looking for the local groom. Where can I find him? If he isn't in the stables, then I've no idea where he's got to. I forget why I was asking about that. Oh, there was a... The innkeeper. Who is it? Is something the the... Yeah, come to the door, ma'am, so I can talk to you. Zlata. Hey. Oh, I can't. Okay. That's weird. What? what the hell are you doing? Shut up. You're about to get yours, son. All right, let's follow this lady. Are you looking for me? No, I don't care about you at all. To be honest, in fact, that we should just piss off. Now I'm invisible. What do you think about them apples? Hide the pig's die. What are you doing there? Shut up! You don't see me. Even that dog doesn't know I'm here. He just felt a little wisp of air go by him. Damn it, I don't know if I should follow these ladies or talk to the dude at night. Shut up! You don't I'm not even here. Who are you talking to? Alright, so let's do this. Let's go try to talk to the guy at the alehouse real quick. And get that done. And then follow them out at night. I think if he's here already, which I'm hoping that he is, we'll be good. Maybe. Okay, okay, there he is. Damn, frame rates tanking. Coming. What is it? The blessings of our Lord be. And with you, lad, take a seat. Make it quick. I gotta hurry. I'm sorry I can't tell you everything. But maybe we can work something out. But first I'd like to hear something about you, my son. With whom do I have the honor? Where are you from? I'm from Scalitz. Oh. I'm sorry. What about your kin? They're dead. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Here, we'll drink to them. It must have been terrible. 
It was terrible. It seemed so pointless. We had no warning. They just appeared and began the slaughter. God knows why. They killed anyone who didn't make it to the shelter of the castle. My parents, my girl, even the Deutsch who was on Sigismund's side. I didn't make it to the castle. I wanted to try and help my parents, but there was nothing I could do. Then I fled to Taunberg with the Cumans on my heels. They almost killed me. They slaughtered people in the surrounding villages. There was a pile of bodies in front of the church in Rovna. Folk who tried to take refuge there, but they... they... My poor child. May God grant them eternal rest. And how did you come to get this assignment? I'd have expected Sir Hanish to send that old grouch, Bernard. He did, but I found a witness and the trail led here to Ujit, so he sent me here to follow it up. Ah, well, congratulations. It's nice to see someone using their head to find things out instead of torture. We'll have to drink to that. Now the most important thing. What actually happened at Noyo? The good My folks pleasure. here about are saying all kinds of terrible things but I take most of it with a pinch of salt. The rumors aren't exaggerated this time, unfortunately. The Neuhof stud farm was raided by bandits, but they didn't come to pillage or even take the horses. They only wanted to kill. They maimed the horses and slaughtered some people. I'm sure they would have killed more, but the bandits quarreled among themselves and broke off the attack. And judging by what's left of our Lubosch, they're still settling accounts. I see it's every bit as bad as people claimed. Dreadful. Well then, here's to those poor souls who had to die so pointlessly and so terribly. I've told you all about me. Now it's your turn, Father. You don't look much like our parish priest at home. I noticed you're pretty handy with a sword. I wouldn't expect that of a man of the cloth. You know what they say. The Lord moves in mysterious ways. But this is a bit more mysterious than others. Let's just say I haven't always been a priest. Fate led me to places where affairs were My settled pleasure. by force. These days, of course, it's just a bit of exercise to keep me in shape. Well, we've had an agreeable chat, but now let's get down to business. So, about this confessional seal. Do you really want more innocent people to die? Henry, that's not how it works. There are matters in which you can't make exceptions because if you do it once, you'll forever be tempted to do it again. If people stop believing in the church because their confessional secrets are betrayed, they won't trust anyone, and that's worse than even the most hideous crime. I understand, but that means I've reached a dead end. Those cutthroats will strike again, and I can't stop them. Chin up, lad. I might have a solution. What? If I tell you what Lubos told me, I'd be betraying the confessional secret. But, first thing tomorrow, I'll try something I think might help you. Word of honor? On my soul. I always wondered about the things a priest tells his congregation. Where else do you get the ideas for your sermons? Well, Ujits is in Prague. It's not enough to instruct people. They have to be entertained, too. If I only read from the Bible, I'd soon be preaching to an empty church. <laughs> Our priest wasn't exactly a bard. So what do you preach to your flock about? It has to be something topical. Condemning vices. And of course, describing them in detail. A tongue lashing about the two popes goes down well these days. And stories from real life, with a nice moral to them, are popular as well. Especially if they're about fornication and similar scandalous vices. Can you give me an example? Well, recently a priest by the name of Jan Hus started preaching in Prague yeah. in the Czech language, and the people liked it. I hear he always has a full house. A journeyman who heard him told me what Hus is yeah. preaching, and I like the sound of it. I'm thinking about putting it in my own repertoire. What's so amazing about it? My the preaching of Master Jan Hus about Mother Church, the lamentable wealth in which the church is drowning has turned to poison. And nearly the whole of Christendom is contaminated. Just like a flock of hungry ravens, they settled on this land to devour every grain of gold and silver. They know no mercy. 
Their hearts are corrupted by longing for wealth, and they shamelessly profit from everything. You want to baptize a child? Pay. You want to steal and murder? Pay, and you will have absolution. What if the devil himself were to pay? Would he ascend to heaven too? With such money gained from the poor, they buy beautiful horses to ride and needless servants to pamper them. They gamble at dice and dress their whores in expensive furs. While Preach it. Jesus Christ walked barefoot and had no place to lay his head. Look to your consciences, you robbers of the poor, for you are seen by God and his people too. Has he been Amen. getting drunker somehow? Well, this Jan Hu's character is quite a rebel. Oh, the congregation will love it. I don't doubt it. Let's drink to that. I think you've had Funny. enough. That last bit reminds me of someone. What do you mean? My situation is completely different. Huth preaches against the prelates and the clerics who are robbing the poor. Look at me. I don't have a pot to piss in. I'm no better off than the folk I preach to. I'm one with them in poverty and suffering and everything that troubles them. I drink with them and curse those stuffed habits in Sasa Monastery. Holy Don't you think it's a bit odd when someone boozes and lives in sin with a woman and then criticizes the Pope for, be, for, for debauchery? No, I don't. What do you think of this Jan Hus? He's certainly a wise man. A little overzealous for my taste. If he got out of Prague and came here for a look, I'm sure he'd stop condemning drinking and lying with women. I'll drink to that. Where can I find out more about his teachings? Do you like it? I copied down some of his sermons. If you're interested, you can read them at my presbytery. <laughs> I might be able to. What do the common folk think of it? Nice. They like it. They're happy to hear someone say what they think themselves, but are afraid to say aloud. Things that make them angry. And they're calling for change. In a few years, it'll have grown beyond control. You mark my words, the people will rise up and the church will be shaken to its very foundations. Yeah, unless they burn him at the stake first. <laughs> Nonsense. They can't burn a master of the most respected university in Europe. Thanks for the sermon, but I think I've been morally uplifted enough. Oh, it's getting quite late. What are your plans, Father? What do you suppose? We have a drink, of course. Well, enjoy it, Father. I have to go now. I'm not much in the mood for a drink. I feel like... I thought you'd be more game. So you won't help me out with that secret? No, I won't. Oh, for God's sake. Thank you very much. Wait, You're what? You're welcome. All of that? And he... <sighs> well, can you drink with him now instead? God be with you. What? Oh, well, that's fucking stupid as hell. Like, he said he was going to fucking do it. Uh, I wanted to go do that other fucking quest. Oh, that's so fucking dumb. Father, didn't I see you outside practicing? Yeah, I know. Oh, that means there'd be something left. Well, that's fucking stupid as fuck. Hey. Like, it sounded like everything up to it was how you earned his trust. And then you earn it, and then he's just like, oh, hey, let's do a drink, too. You're like, no, nah, I got shit to do. And he's like, oh, well, pff, never mind. Like, that, that, was, that was pretty fucking dumb. That was really fucking dumb. Like, at least give me the option to go, fine, if you're going to be that way, we'll drink. Don't be like, oh, well, no, nah, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to find you this murderer because you wouldn't have drink with me. That's fucking dumb as hell. That was really, really forced. So fucking stupid. Because I wanted to get this quest done, too. I wanted to knock them both out at the same time. All right, fuck him. I don't know. I mean, I guess we got to have some other way to uh, figure out how to how to do that quest then. Because that's a main story quest, so it has to be some other way.
Uh, where's my speech? Oh, no, wait, that sort of counts as a stat. Final offer, that's the one we talked about before. You see the counterpart stats and skill checks. That seems okay. Increase your speech skill and haggling. Oh, you get a 50% higher rep when you talk to women, so you can persuade them more easily, and you can avail of Bath Winch's services for free. Hell yeah. You know I'm picking that up. Regardless, definitely picking that up. I'm not taking a torch out on purpose, by the way, so I can sneak up on these guys. Or girls, whatever. How close are we, by the way? At least they're still marked on the map. All right, let's sneaky sneak. Getting pretty close. Uh, it's bush. Holy shit, it's dark. Goddamn bushes. What? Don't be like, oh, what's that? You didn't hear shit, bitches. Noise thirty-two. All right, what can we what can we lose? Twenty. Oh, wow, that actually makes us less visible. What? That doesn't help either way. We'll lose that. All right, so let's get our noise to 16 and visibility to 32. Well, to be fair, it is in the forest at fucking night. I can barely see him. Which, again, how are they getting around without torches? I'm doing my sneak and I'm doing like the snow, slow sneak. Yeah, I heard them talk, but I don't know if they heard me or not. I lost sight of them. Oh, there's one. Oh, they're on the path. Okay. Hopefully they didn't already do what they did. We're going to do. I'm afraid they might have. So we might have missed both this quest, which I mean, we probably can do this one tomorrow too. Yeah, I think they're like splitting up now because they're leaving the forest. So not only did we miss this, at least for the night, we also missed the other damn quest. It's not even that late. It's like 10 o'clock. Yeah, they're definitely leaving the forest. God damn it. I wonder if I can like go up to them and talk to them then. How old is the latest save? It's 40 minutes ago. I don't know if I want to bother. Nah. I'm trying to remember, like, where it saved at. I'm trying to talk to them now. Yeah, because they're definitely leaving. You're not going to ask, hey, why the hell are you out? In the middle of nowhere. Nope. I kind of do want to load it just because that one. Like, I'm all about like keeping our penalties and whatnot, but that was just fucking stupid. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah, that was dumb. Like that was just that was just flat out stupid. That wasn't like, oh, 
Like, I didn't go the way I wanted. Like, it was just fucking stupid that he, the way they wrote that was really bad. I don't, I'm not worried about them, the ladies. So what is it now we have to go talk to her? Ugh, god damn it. Like, that part's not so bad, because I think theirs isn't specific, because he wants me to meet that night. So, that one's more specific. So, the, but the ladies, I think we just need to follow one night. So that, I don't think is going to be too much of an issue. I don't think. Turn the camera on. There it goes. Yeah, that was dumb. Wait, what? put your damn bow away. You're going to scare the peasants. Go, horse. Ah, uh, god damn it. We're going to have to retrain. I probably won't bother haggling. I'll probably just pay whatever she wants. Just to avoid that back and forth. To where we didn't already have a fast travel to her. Got the horsemanship perk earlier. Must have went a different way. Yeah, we went a completely different way. Wait, did we go on the right one? Okay. We okay. We just went a really different way. Wow. So at least we discovered some new areas. That's nice. Go for an opening in the woods so we don't run into the damn bushes. I'm wondering if we're gonna find some kind of weird ritual site or some shit. What, are you running out of... Oh, you are out of stamina, my bad. Interesting that the horse starts, like, shaking its head and stuff when it is getting out of stamina to let you know, like, hey, I'm about to... I can throw your ass. That looks kind of suspicious. Scared the hell out of those deer, I bet. Uh, we need to lockpick that stuff too again. Just for the experience, if nothing else. We'll blow through her dialogue really quick. I'll come in the name of who And I was gonna talk to her for the XP. Do you know Do you know That's all. Thank you. I've come from the priest. Me. Don't you know that there's a what kind of will you give a so there? I think I'll be that dark. I did what did they eat? I've Get the two trainings that we did. Would you teach me something about medicinal? Certainly. I'm interested in more advanced techniques. All right, but it'll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's actually, not we'll hide a lot. That. Agreed. Now. Gives me a weird eye when she does that. I don't know much I like that. I'm just gonna do the one. Where are you? Damn, where are you at? There you are. That one got rougher near the end. Give me all this. All right. And let's drop that.
that stuff off again. The hides. All right. And you know what? We're going to fast travel back. Oh. I'm not even going to bother picking their door. Did we get another skill unlock picking when we did that? We did get a speech crest though, but that was skill, but that was when we talked to the old man. Come on. There he goes. All right. I'm trying to think of anything else I want to do while we're here. Otherwise, I'm just going to wait. Oh, no, he's already here. We'll blow it to his dialogue, too. Uh, with it being I'm so sorry, early, we might actually everything. still be able to catch them. But maybe we can work. But first, I'll... Oh, I'm from I was like trying to hit one. Uh, they're dead. I'm in my... God knows. I didn't... And how did you it's so with... weird that those are timed. He did. Uh, now the most the, the noise. I well, I've told you all about. Like it seems really random. I noticed that they're uh, Look, they're timed. These days, like well, why those? So, and if I am what? Well, if I well, on and good uh, health. Well, it has to be. A t a sp well, I on what? So the uh, this is when he goes on that huge spiel. Yeah, his voice acting is really weird. Also, during this whole sequence, like, their talking started to get more slurred as if they had been drinking, even though they're obviously not actually drinking. Especially because at the end, he specifically says, hey, let's drink. I, I feel like there was some miscommunication there. Yeah, I didn't get a skill that time in talking, which is fucking is annoying. But it means we're getting it soon. Ah, that sounds like a good plan. I knew you wouldn't let Yeah, me like know. they're acting like they're drunk. And we got a new level in drinking. Ah, shit. They'll probably end up being stuck here all night, so we can't follow those ladies. Father gets all the ladies. Father likes the debauchery. Yeah, I almost chose not drink. I'd have been pissed. Wow, gambling too, Father? Like, I should get a strength point too. Enough of this, bailiff. Come on over here, sit down, and have a drink with us. Don't vex me again, father. It's three hours past dusk, and curfew is long gone. So what? So? I'll have you all whipped and put in the stocks, and I'll write a letter to the bishop about you, priest. Well, nothing to worry about then. Everyone knows the only one around here who can write is me. <laughs> Enough! Men, throw them out. Whoop their asses. Come on, Henry. Oh. You looking for a fight? Henry, back me up. Oh, I'd gladly murder these guys. Uh, 
We gotta beat their asses too? I actually don't mind too much about that. I wanna put my sword out though. They probably would get a little pissy about that. Are we trying to hit the priest from behind? You little bitch. Hit him in the legs. What? You gonna pry, baby? Yeah, keep blocking my punches with your fists. Would you hit him, please? You have plenty of stamina. Why do you just stop attacking? The hand to hand definitely doesn't feel like it's as good done. Be a bit more careful. Oh, you want some of this shit now. I'm gonna fucking wail on that face, bitch. Yes! Look to the sky in victory. Wait. Oh, I am. Oh, hey. Oh, it's this piece of shit. The bailiff. Fuck you, bailiff. <laughs> piece of shit. Throw you in the stockade, motherfucker. Uh, what? Je <laughs> oh, God. Damn it. Climb the bell tower. Sup, maids. How we doing? Hello, the mighty. Watch the step, my dears. Careful, you don't hurt yourself. Godwin, you're a buffoon. You're a buffoon? Oh, wait, what? What are you... Uh, he wanted me in there. Oh, hell yeah. <sighs> Nothing makes a lady randy as getting drunk and watching you beat somebody's ass. Oh. <laughs> we can't do this, can we? Who says? <laughs> Get ringing, wench. <laughs> <laughs> Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha, Henry, he is a trick. He said, ring it, winch, and you run this it. This is wonderful. <laughs> oh, can't even hold your liquor. Ah, bloody oaf. Shut the fuck up and go home. No time for losers. And now, my dears, comes the climax of the evening. Don't fall out the window. I need your information. Godwin, you old goat. Come here. Oh, he took both. That's not fair. Oh, 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 oh. oh see, he's got Priest both of them. What the fuck? Up. What do you say, Henry? Shall we take a little ride of our own? Well, I mean, if you're going to take advantage of me while I'm drunk, I guess I can. Yeah, it's it's gonna be the mini game. Hey, sex gonna be a mini game in God of War. Uh, to keep your penis erect, press the mouse up button. Me, me, oh God! Please don't tell me that was a hallucination, and I had sexual congress with a sheep. Me, me, <laughs> God damn it! My drunkometer. Should we bay me, with the father? No, this is medieval times. They don't have venereal diseases yet. Is my head on crooked? It might be. I can see my shoulder. <laughs> Wee. Well, I have to say that was a fine evening. <laughs> You'd think he'd be fairly good at this by now. Yeah, but you only live to be like 25, so it's fine how many 